Let's go. Who's Who's the candidate there? I'm right, right there. Okay. Hi, I'm Good morning. Nice to meet you. Sorry for your loss. You know what? Well, we're going to talk about that because it's, it's not a sorrowful day. Oh, yeah? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, I understand you want to talk a little bit, then I'll go over the line. Okay? The best I can to describe, and I'd like to bring family members in. This is his, this is his younger son, Joe. How's that doing? Thank you for and, coming. And, Joe, and two of Joe's sons. Oh, three of them. They're all three of here. Nice. Um, I'm overwhelmed. This is the biggest group I've rode with. I mean, I've been part of the Patriot Guard and Legion Riders for two years. I really, really appreciate it. The man. Um, there's no sorrow. It, 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 it's a loss, but it, you know he lost he lost his wife for 67 years, two years ago. And uh, but the fortunate side of that for all of us, I think, is he got to fly to California because when when he retired, him and his wife Audrey, and please call him Vernon. He, he, Vernon, that's the name his mom gave him. Um, they, they 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 built a successful life out here. Had 11 kids. 35 grandchildren, 40 plus great and great grandchildren. Um, successful in life, love, everything. Always had a smile on his face. The only time he ever talked to me about the war was was one time. And you, need, you tell him you need to get it off his chest. And, uh, he struggled with being a Catholic and having to, to, to do what he had to do. And he, he fought some demons, but he on the on the outside of it, man, he plowed through life. He never criticizing anybody, always accepting everybody. And he was a great man. And I thank you again. We honored him last night as a man today. I'm honored. I can tell you, for a lot of us, Beth, it's an honor to be here. Yeah, and Thank sorry you. about having to wear the tie. My wife wasn't going to let me in church with that one. <laughs> so, <laughs> no meter. She's the youngest of 11, so she's kind of scrappy. She had to be that way. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, you got anything to say? No. That's it. I know he loves seeing you guys here. I'm glad I had the honor of meeting him. Yeah, no. His last year... I, my, I am, too. His loss is kind of my game. Because when, when you're in a family this size, you, you really never get a chance to get one-on-one -on -one with somebody. So when he was out here in California finishing up his life, I got to take him crab meets and work with them and, and meet, spend time with them that I never got to. Because right when I married the family, we were not 20, it was 27 years ago. He was, he was retired, he was moving out of California. And it's precious time to cut free the burrito people, the, the burrito yeah, yeah, And they got to meet these guys. That was one of the greatest uh, moments that we had, uh, you know, and, and just to be invited and to come down and see your dad at that, at that event was uh, pretty special. These guys, these guys walk six blocks. I got a great story about that. So I took off and I was riding by my, my sister-in-law's house down in the, the, the burrito run down in Gilroy. And she lived in Morgan, you know, I was there. And I thought, oh, I've got, my, their family's always on me. Get them out of the house. Get them out of the house. So I pulled over and I, I got them down there. And these guys had already left the post. And uh, so I'm like, well, I got to go get those guys, you know. So, but it was interesting because as I'm walking down the street, the word of a World War II vet being in that post surpassed me. It, it actually, I could hear it. Oh, there's a World War II vet. There's a World War II vet. There's a World War II vet. These guys walked about six to eight blocks. To come, to come meet my father-in-law. It was awesome. And then bring him to the Memorial Day. He met a handful more of you at the Memorial Day celebration down here at Oak Hill. And that was a great event and timely. And uh, I want to trade those notes for a second. So thank you. So we got guys from here from Monterey, Hollister, San Diego County. We got the 6 San Diego County. We got guys from here. All over the place back here. Standing in the valley. Standing in the valley? Yeah. yeah. So, this is on a Wednesday. Go to a conference. If you had to take a vacation day, that's awesome. <laughs> and if, if you're retired, then it's the greatest thing in the world. Yeah, they're all about my words. Would you be opposed to us uh, getting all together here? I would love a, to have us all get together. A, shop, a quick 
group shot here, guys? This is like a congressman or something. <laughs> 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 it's usually like eight to ten guys.